So number two is just because you feel that he's the one doesn't make him the one. And and I know there's a lot of confusion here because, you know, we, we get a lot of women that come in and, and I, you know, obviously I'm not a woman. So I don't know some of these kind of womanly things that women have going on. But women have kind of this like supernatural intuition thing going on. And sometimes I think the wires get a little crossed, right? Like the wires get connected to things that shouldn't be getting connected to. And they kind of, a lot of women will confuse things where they're like, oh, okay, I'm, this guy is the one I'm in love with this guy. He's perfect. We're perfect for each other. This is going to a match made in heaven. Right. And they kind of throw that onto the guy and the guy's like, I don't even really like, I'm not really that into her. Right. And she's over here like, Oh my God, like this is the most amazing guy. And this happens with guys with women as well. But it's one of those things where it's like not, you know, just because you feel that way doesn't mean that it's necessarily that way. I actually had a bunch, (laughs) I had a bunch of experiences like this in my past, actually, not where I was thinking she was the one that there was, the the first time I ever felt that way about a woman was actually when I was in high school and I, I wanted to marry my high school sweetheart and she cheated on me with a bunch of people. It's a really sad story. But there, when I was in my mid-20s, I had a few women that I dated had told me that I was their one, right? They were like, you know, I had a couple women where they were like, yeah, you're the one for me. You're the one, right? And I was just like... I remember hearing them say that and I had been dating a lot at that time and I was just like, I don't think I'm the one and guess what? I wasn't the, I wasn't the one for any of them. My suggestion is that even if you feel really, really heavily for a guy and you think he's perfect and you think he's the one and you guys think that you're going to have babies and all that kind of stuff, stick to the game plan, right? I put together a game plan for you specifically in the Forever Woman program. If you want to go check that out, there's a link in the description. My suggestion is no matter how you feel for a guy, make sure you stick to the plan and don't get caught up in this kind of idea of fantasy uh, that he is the one when he might he may or may not be, you know, and, and if he if he's not feeling it the way that you're feeling it, it it might be a really kind of painful experience for you. And like I said, guys guys run into this as well.